dear travelers! What a splendid sight to behold! Here we stand at the precipice of musical mastery it missed the celestial symphony of the Lear's melodies. But before we delve into the final lesson, let us take a moment to celebrate how far you've come. Congratulations, my fellow lyricists! You've journeyed through the winds of Animo, dancing with the melodies of Del Miso, Weaving tales with the harmonies of brief voila, and transversing the realms of miso tea. Truly, your dedication knows no bounds. As the god of animal, and Mondstadt's most illustrious bard, I must say your progress fills me with boundless joy. Each note you've mastered is a testament to your passion and dedication to the art of music. So raise your leers high, dear travelers, and let the winds of Tibet carry your melody. Oh, what do we have here? You thought this was over? How quaint. It seems you still have much to learn. I am Arlie Kino, also known as the Knave, fourth of the Fatui Harbingers, and also current director of the House of Hearth. You may address me as you wish. Today, I shall nine to impart upon you the advanced techniques of the Lear, beginning with the illustrious melody known as Do Mi So Ti. Consider yourselves fortunate to receive such an education from one of my stature. Let's not waste any more time with pleasantries. You're here to learn, so let's get to it. Now, pay attention, children. We're not here to waste time with trivialities. The Do Mi So Ti scale, as you've undoubtedly heard, is the pentacle of musical expression on the lyre. Each note, from Do to T, carries its own weight and significance, but when combined in sequence, they form a harmonious symphony that transcends mere music. Remember, my dear students, mastery of the lyre requires precision, focus, and above all, a keen understanding of the nuances of each note. Allow me to introduce you to the Do Mi Fa La scale, a melody that dances on the edges of eternity. In this scale, we shall explore the delicate interplay of each note's each one a whisper in the timeless symphony of existence. Remember, dear students, that the mastery of the lyre requires not only technical skill, but also an appreciation for the subtle nuances of music. Here, at the heart of Mondstadt, we come full circle. Behold, the Re Fa So T scale the final piece of our musical journey. In this scale, we embrace the essence of beginnings and endings, each melody a reflection of the cosmos. As we traverse the notes from Re to T, let us remember that music is more than just sound. It is the language of the universe speaking to us in whispers and echoes. Ah, the intricacies of music, a reflection of life's complexities. How fascinating it is to witness the evolution of understanding in such fledgling minds. They think they've mastered the lyre, but little do they know the true depth of its secrets. Perhaps one day, they'll come to realize the melody of existence extends far beyond their mortal comprehension. Until then, let them revel in the illusion of mastery. <laughs> <laughs>